Well, the state is laying out the evidence for jurors who will soon decide if Jermaine Washington is the one who killed Dorian Colston July 4th weekend 2018. Today, jurors heard testimony from one of Washington's associates who allegedly played a role in the hit. Jurors have heard several associates of Washington testify about texts and conversations about a hit on Dorian Colston. Witness Carrington Kiki Henry took the stand in orange jail clothes to tell how Washington offered to pay him to be his driver during the killing. Henry talked about driving Washington to meet Colston. He testified Washington walked to Colston's car, got in, and killed him. Henry testified he saw a flash of fire as he looked toward his rearview mirror toward Colston's car. Henry also talked about getting $2,000 for driving, but said he was promised $5,000. Prosecutors say the alleged hit was initiated by Josiah Jackson, who wanted Colston dead so he wouldn't rob him. Henry also told about the gun being ditched in a storm drain near North Jake and Opelousa Streets back in 2018. About two weeks ago, Henry revealed to authorities where the gun had been tossed, and deputies found the badly corroded gun in the storm drain. The gun was inoperable due to exposure to the elements, but investigators say it contained red-painted bullets connected to the case. Jurors saw photos of the storm drain, gun, and red bullets in the courtroom. A state police firearms analysis expert testified she examined the badly damaged gun, and the testing determined the shell casing and evidence did come from from the weapon. Teresa Schmidt, 7 News. Now also today, some jurors express discomfort running into audience members from the courtroom congregating in the parking lot where jurors park. Court security took measures to designate separate areas for jurors and spectators. The defense asked for a mistrial, but the judge denied it. The trial is expected to wrap up tomorrow.